A custom clothier has converted his alterations business into a mask making operation. News Channel 5's Alexandra Cohen shows us how they're making a difference one mask at a time. On a typical day, feared bespoke and only one tailoring is filled with custom clothes and outfits waiting to be altered. Usually these women are making suits, but right now they're donating their time to make masks for people who need them. We saw the ability with our machines upstairs and here we are. Aaron McGill is the owner. He says they've donated more than 4,000 masks to frontline workers, and it was made possible by monetary donations from his clients. There was one nursing home in Western Kentucky, where I'm originally from, that received 200, and random hospitals throughout Nashville have received them, and now we're making them out of Halyard 600 material, which is sterilization wrap that's used in hospitals. After getting feedback from medical experts, his team is altering the way these are created. A little bit more sterile, a little bit better filtration than standard cotton. As donations run dry, Aaron recently started selling masks on his website, which is helping a foundation feed the hungry amid COVID-19. Some of the proceeds are going to the AIM Foundation so they can uh, do the good work that they do around Nashville. While they're still making masks, Aaron is beginning to switch gears, preparing to reopen soon if all goes as planned. It's been a wild ride, uh, to say the least. Reporting in Nashville, Alexandra Cohen, News Channel 5.